Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play Shadow Tower, the I am going to die a horrible death edition, because that seems to be what's happening. Remember that secret passage I decided to go through? Did not realize it was going to be such a giant secret passage of, oh hey, there's those bats, what do you know? Oh, you know what I can actually find out? Some of those crazy enemies that I was fighting in the last episode, I can actually figure out what the hell they are with the creature book, I just realized. Alright, so Blood Slime. Highly poisonous slime. Movement is similar to acid slime, but somewhat slower. Sprays poison. Oh, I thought it was fire. But... What do you know? Alright. Fanged worm. Snake-like creature which eliminates any prey nearing its hole with its fearsome fangs and powerful poison. Parasite. Insectivorous. Parasite which inhabits corpses. Hides within the body of a corpse and strikes out when prey approaches. Casket. A cursed tree with a human skull embedded in it. It won't attack, but carries a powerful drain field. Acid skull. Giant skull filled with slime. Besides its horrifying appearance, it, it sometimes spits corrosive acid. Yeah. Don't like that one. Wait. Were there as many creatures as I just thought there I said there were? Which is awesome if that's the, set, the factor. I'd be really excited about that. 150. That's pretty sick. That's a large number. I like that. Another cool thing about this game. Now let's survive and not have my weapon die. That's I think that's the main thing. Short Star is already at 3 out of 12 durability. Alright. Alright. Let's make this work. Hey, bats. How about you not shoot sonic waves at me? Because when I'm trying to just, you know, just trying to get through. Come on. Did I get it? I think I did. There we go. There we go. I'm just worried about the other one. Ooh, we dropped a sword. That's awesome. Okay. At least we'll have another weapon for the time being. Alright, these guys aren't so bad. As long as you know how to... Or you have time to walk around them. It works a lot like Kingsfield where there's a meter at the left that charges up. And you have to wait for that to be able to strike. Alright, cool. Now I can actually do some real damage. And we got a healing potion. Alright, we're in a good spot again. Alright, let's go ahead and equip this sword. Man, this... Oh, yeah, good timing. Durability at 2. Alright, this is 12 out of... Long sword, 12 out of 15. 17, 57 speed. Speed's obviously lower, but everything else is much more powerful, so... I like it. Much more powerful. Durability is 12 out of 15. I will take that gladly. I know there's another item over there. I just want to check to see if there's anything in the graves. Oh. What do you know? What? Oh, hi. The answer is yes. And there's a spider who decided to come hang out. That's cool. I like how there's all these random enemies that just appear. Alright. It's like this guy. Okay, fine. I, I, I took him out of the grave. Where'd this spider come from? Alright. Well, we got another health potion. So all is good. Hey, you think you can deal? You think you can deal with my new sword? Oh, okay, apparently they just respawn here. I don't quite get that respawn mechanic and what makes it happen. Or it's just like a random every so often thing when you're in a room. Okay, apparently there's another one. Oh, there it is. That's fantastic. Really glad to see that. Oh, here's another secret, I think. I also realize I missed the coin. I, I know that. I'll go back and get it. Oh, so this is just a drop to, uh, not your death, but just a big drop. We'll come back to that. Lots of things to come back to. Alright, what is this? It's a torch. It's a torch! We'll take it. I don't feel... I, I'm like, I'm mixed on if I should really be attacking these guys or not, since I don't get EXP for them, as far as I can tell. It seems like it could be a waste. Okay, well I got that, which is nice. But like, unless you get the drop from them, which is good, is it really worth it? And I don't know if it is. Alright. I mean, I guess if you're really farming for drops, but once you get far further in the game, do you really want to waste your durability to fight these guys? I think that's where the big question is going to come into play. Alright. Now we're going where we're supposed to be going, and it feels like it. That side area, I definitely... Oh, the hidden region. We're back in the hidden region. Alright. Cool. Ish. Ish. This whole game is just like... Hey, wanna die? Cool. 
This is the game. I mean, I like it. It's just funny how difficult this is to me, considering how used to Kingsfield I am from software. Hey, it's a ah, serpent lady. Human. Oh, well. What do you want? I want you, baby. I want you. That's all I've ever wanted. A scared feather. A soul pod. With 14 sp Oh, wow. Coins are actually worth a lot. Like, you can see that it doesn't take many coins to get things. I should probably wait until I can get a beast key, though. Yes. Mmm, yes. Let us wait until we can do that. I'm going to save it for the beast key. Normally, I would just go ahead and buy the soul pod with 14 SP. I mean, it's probably actually worth it to save up for the 5 coin one, but... Especially since I already have 4 coins, but I think... Um, I think we should save up for that beast key. It's my hunch. Because you know, gotta unlock all the treasure chests. Or whatever doors it could unlock. Or the, the key to the beast's heart. My name is Bell, and this is my key. Oh, sick! One hit kills now. Nice. With this sword, at least. I mean, I'm still not high level, but... Hey! Well, level. You know what I mean. You know what I mean. I'm still not there. Oh, sh whoops. There we go. I mean, I still haven't used enough of those soul things that I feel super confident in myself. Hey, it's one of these things. It recognized this from Demon Souls? And or real life. Okay, that's where we snuck through the other time. Is this room, is this the other side of that room where I was in the this area before? You can just walk on things. <laughs> She's like, you don't give a fuck. You just walk on everything. Oh, wait, what's this? Another one of these tome things. I really should have opened it before. I forgot I got that. All right, let's see. So I'm going to use a healing potion. All right, let's check this out. What is this? Dorado's Ashes. Fixes items and weapons. Uh, wait, did that just fix every item and weapon? Uh, it looks like it. Okay. Should we stick to the sword? Oh, it just fixes whatever you have equipped. I think. Because, I mean, obviously it didn't equip that. That sucks, though, because, like, how do I now fix my boots? I mean, it's good. It heals everything, but... Still not the best. Definitely good to keep in mind, though. Now I finally have a way to heal all my stuff. So Dorado's Ashes, that's that's the way. All right, I have a feeling that this is just going to circle back to the other... The other, other... All right. Well, then. Apparently, this is actually where I am supposed to be. Cool game. Cool. <laughs> uh, this is so hard. <laughs> uh, I just want to find where the save point is. Just so I know I can save it. Alright. Alright. Let's just go through here and deal with this casket. I'm just gonna drain my health with this field of drainage. Hey, screw you, you asshole. No. 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 Bad casket. I see you draining my health. I see... Oh, God. Oh, God. Is it just... Okay, I guess it's just a full field, but... Alright, we got another torch. Uh, what did I just pick up? What just happened? I don't even know. I think I picked something up though. Ooh! Ooh, yes, 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 yes. <laughs> yes, 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 I will take that. Alright, I want to see if there's something that I picked up that I didn't notice. Alright, healing potion, acid, Dorado's ashes. Uh, I don't notice anything. Alright, so... More strength. More defense. I don't know what balance is, but I'll take some. It's up my soul. Don't know what it is, but it sounds important. Go more strength. Sure. I have no clue. I really have no clue. I mean, I have a base idea of what things do, but I don't know what a good build is. I just, I don't know. Okay, what is this? This is new, too. I'm assuming it's some sort of poison heal, because that's what those guys do. So it makes sense that's what they would drop. Poison vaccine. Alright. Vaccines are... Oh, that sounds nice. Sounds good. I don't see any of those... Oh, there's the casket. I was like, before there are caskets in here. <gasps> oh, these guys drop coins. And coins are actually pretty awesome. Okay. You have a giant field of range. You have a really huge range. 
Get out of here. With your range. Oh, another sword. And it's new shield. Alright, let's see what's, what's better. So far, I haven't noticed much in terms of weight and how much it seems to affect things. And Kingsfield is pretty distinct. Deadly short sword. Six strength, 95 speed. And it's slash and pierce are pretty high. Uh, and it's SPR is good and smelt is good. I don't know what SPR is though. I guess if I level up again, I'll have to real. Oh, it's spirit. It's spirit. That's what it is. Don't know what that is. I'm assuming it's better, but I'm going to stick to my longsword for now just because I have more durability with it. That's the only reason. Oh, I also should have checked my shield out. Speaking of which, I wonder if my other shield is dead. Nope. Other shield is good. Alright, so large shield is better. It looks like. Yes, it is. Alright, so we're switching to the large shield then. Cool. A little bit better now. A little bit better for it. More torches. Still, I'm, I guess there's going to be really dark rooms. This is uh, Dark Souls 2, the real edition right here. I would really like to know how to save. I keep on thinking it's going to be those bonfires. I've hidden myself and survived. I have no hopes of ever escaping this tower. Why must I live this life of torment? I don't know. Because you chose to chase the darkness like me? We're darkness chasers. It goes with the territory. Think about it. That's that's what I, I signed up for when I said, I want to chase the darkness. I want a life of torment. That's exactly why I did it. 100%. I'm also going to take this picture, please. Nope. Nope. Okay. All right, well, I guess that worked out pretty good. We got we got more levels of stuff, essentially. I became more powerful. I got a nice shield. This stuff's good. Okay, before I go there, I do want to take out that dragon dude. He's got to go. I, I was scared before. Oh, I wonder if this drop is the one that I warped to before, right? and then it's just like a shortcut back. I do wonder that. Okay, I got to figure out which side to take. There we go. Let's take this side. As I assumed. As I assumed. I was like, I figured you'd be like that. You'd be one of those guys who's only good when you are in the correct spin location. You gotta use that sidestep strats. Sidestep strats. Ooh, a rapier that just fell into a giant hole that I really don't want to drop into. That's cool. Hey, look, it's a soul thing. Now I can get more level ups. Or whatever those, a chest piece, as I like to say. And more toxic resistance. And whatever this item healing, I guess it's just a regular healing potion. Okay. I'm, I'm tempted to drop in there. There's all these drops that I'm afraid of. And it's just really that I really want to find a save point. That's what a lot of it is, is me wanting to find a save point. Alright, let's see. Um, use item. Let's level up a little bit more. Oh, God, I, it doesn't, if you press up, it doesn't fast send you up there. A soul pod, so it is a soul. All right, let's go there. I'm going to level up my soul again, because I have no idea what it does, but it seems good. Soul. I got so much soul, baby. I'm like an R&B singer. That's how much soul I have. You can't even counter that much soul when you sing R&B. And soul, and I sing soul. R&B and soul. That's how much soul I've got. That's what I do. All right, it's a crown, which means absolutely nothing to me. Let's do it. I, I, oh, oh, there's the save point. There we go. Now I feel comfortable and secure in my sexuality. <laughs> Sorry, I don't, I don't know why. It just seemed like a funny thing to say. As I was saying, I feel comfortable and secure. I was like, why don't I add this on? This, this is fun. To say. Okay, so the next area to go to is going to be either the drops or I go into scary demon skull land. Let's go demon scary demon skull land. Sounds like a fun plan. If I die, it's all good. I've got all these great items now, and it's wonderful. Beautiful. Beautiful. It'll be great. Alright, so crown means a save point. Feather means a warp point. I guess that makes sense. You think of feathers and flying. You think of crowns and um, and monarchs. They're, they're for saving, I guess. And I don't remember what the other sign is 
for a shop, but I, I know I'll recognize it if I see it. Go away, slime spew dude. Uh-huh. No, I... Okay, apparently I didn't get poisoned somehow. That seems lucky. Oh, God. Oh, God. No, you guys want to spew your... Po oh, oh, your poison mist field. Okay. Dude, you've been smoking way too much if that's how much comes out of your breath all the time. Or you just never brush your teeth. I'm gonna go, you never brush your teeth if that's how much gaseous goose comes out of you. And you breathe. Please brush your teeth. That This is what this whole game is actually about. It's a PSA. Public service announcement saying please brush your teeth. So you don't just breathe out yellow funk on the people. I get it, you're a skeleton, you're dead, it's hard for you to brush your teeth because you don't have any hands. It is a real conundrum, but it's still rude. It's rude. You're straight rude. This really is a creepy- I like how creepy looking the enemies are in this game, I am a fan of that. Okay. Well, what does this say on the wall? Oh, no, really though. No, re no, no really. There we go. Death visits suddenly, and none can escape it. Well, I mean, I guess it's true. Oh, cool. I, yep, I was trying to knock you over. That's definitely what my plan was. Can I get... Oh, he has a key? What if it's the beast key? Oh, no, he's going to have the jail key. That, that would make the most sense. It's definitely going to be the jail key. But let's double check. He has the brass key, which is a jail key. There we go. Because it makes sense. Oh. The skeleton has just appeared. A skeleton has invaded. Hello. I heard you. Let me show you the welcoming committee. You don't always hurt them for full for whatever reason. I don't quite... I guess it depends on where you hit them. Oh, nice. A rapier. A rapier. Yes, I know. It's technically rapier. I know. I know. Cool, red one, yay! Oh, do I need to actually do this? Okay. All right, it's like Kingsfield where you have to actually choose the item. No, no. All right, what about now? Use item. I just want to say hello. Oh, there we go. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. No. Red bloody death breath. Okay. Secret passages. Secret. Nope. No secret passages. That's cool. That's cool. Just waste my time. Look at all this loading that I have to do just to use a key. You gonna say there's no secret passages? Oh, skeleton came out of nowhere. That's awesome. See, that time I got a full hit. So I'm imagining it depends on where you hit him. And that was time I was a full hit too. I think I remember Terramantis. Terramantis has played this game before, and I think I remember him telling me there was limb uh, damage outputs and such. I really do want to... Uh, hell, okay. Hello? Hello? Hi, that's cool. I was about to say, I really want to go in there, and then I saw bodies flailing into it. I gotta say, this is pretty fun. I, I hope this is fun for you guys. It's kind of fun reacting to everything for real. <laughs> It's not that I fake my reactions, but I mean, it's just funny when it's like, I legitimately don't know that something's going to happen. So, as opposed to like, you know, when I know things are going to happen, I react, I try to react accordingly. It's just like, oh yeah, like this is where this is going to happen, and just do it more explanatory. Unless the enemy spooks me or pops out of somewhere, but this is j legit. Too legit, one might say. Some may say. But one in particular, you know what I'm talking about, I think. Alright, not that way. This was that awesome room, I remember that. Oh, hello? Hello noises, where did you come from? Can't tell. All good, more loading. <laughs> it's... They really, I don't know what it is and why the loading's so bad for the menu, but I, I get that the menu looks nice, especially when you go into your full armor to see what you're, you look like all decked out. I get that, but 
overall, I feel like they they had to do something to fix this menu because this type of loading, where it just takes a while to load a menu to look around, is really unnecessary. You could do a better job on the GUI. Like, Kingsfield is more basic than this, and I prefer it, because at least it doesn't have to consistently load. Are you going to be a dead monster? See, that time, that time I was ready. I was watching for it. It's funny that you knock them over when you try to check them. I mean, I guess it's realistic. It's like, how dare you just knock people over? I don't know, man. I don't know. There's just bodies littered everywhere. You're welcome. You are welcome. Oh, hi. Another skeleton, apparently. That's cool. What are you, you going to do for me? Nothing. That's what I've discovered. You guys do nothing for me. Okay, well... Wait, is that a warp point or is that a save point? It's probably a warp point. Wait, uh, it's a save point. What do you know? Let's save it. That's so f I could have saved it earlier and I had no idea because I thought it was a warp point. Well, that's cool. Let's go ahead and save it. I feel real good about this now. I know where two save points are. You know, I could also do that fall, that drop, and see where that leads to. I mean, I do have a feeling that it's going to just be that what I thought it was, but I could check it. I could do it. Or I could keep going forward. Let's keep going forward for now. We'll come back to the drops. It will happen. Shadow Tower? I hadn't even made it to the Shadow Tower yet. But where's Shadow Tower Abyss? Oh, is this where I started but higher up? Oh, that's so cool. Okay, let's go back, actually. Let's go back. I want to check all those drop areas before we move on in the Shadow Tower. Let's go back to the Forgotten region. That is cool, though. I really like that it's bringing you back into the Shadow Tower area. I'm going to have to look up next time I go there and see if you can see all the uh, the connections that I'm assuming we're going to eventually take. Because if they have all that existing stuff there, I mean, that would make sense for why it takes time to load the Shadow Tower, because otherwise it's a pretty small area. Unless they have to load all of the building that you look up at and down at. Man, this makes me excited, too. I want to somehow play Shadow Tower Abyss. I just have to figure out how. Oh, wow. I didn't get hurt at all. I'm used to King's Feel with all the fall damage. I'm assuming you do eventually get hurt, but that was nothing. Well, apparently I was wrong about the drop. Cool. <laughs> Good thing I saved it, because who knows what this is going to lead to. Because I sure don't. Oh, we're back in the Shadow Tower. Uh, hey, well, we can look up again. That's That's cool. Okay. Well, um, apparently, yep, you can see things. That's great. I like that. Well, I guess we'll just follow this part of the Shadow Tower and see where it takes us. That looks like an interesting room. What's going to be over here, though? Well, I, I just skip interesting rooms. I'm like, that looks like a really interesting room. Nope, just kidding. We're... Oh, that one is too. Well, I already started going this way, so let's do this one. Hmm. The Earth World Poisonous Cavern. Oh no. I know I have all this anti poison stuff, but I just don't like poison areas. If you watch my Dark Souls Super Show, you may have surmised that. I don't want to save it. I don't want to. The fact that I'm stuck here for the time being makes me not want to save it. It seems like a bad idea to be like, oh, why don't I save it somewhere where I'm currently stuck? Oh, oh, hi. Oh, hello, eyeball plant. You're exactly what I was expecting to see. And actually, not too bad. It just caught me by surprise to see a laser beam shooting at me. I like the enemies in this game. I can't say that enough, but I really like them. They've, so far, they've been pretty diverse. This is actually really cool. I know Terramensis was telling me that he, he's not the biggest Kingsfield guy, but he really likes Shadow Tower, and he thinks it's a better game. So I was like, I don't know, man. It's pretty high standards to hold, because I love King's Field. Stop laughing at me, plant. Oh, he slowed me down. That's what he's doing. Well, my favorite status effect, being slowed down. Actually, I, I think all of them. <laughs> For the most part, all of them are pretty annoying. I think he just had some stuff coming down from the bottom at me. Oh, no, I got hit by the laser. Okay, that's cool. Now can I run? Oh, nope, I saw the one ton effect on me. Guys, oh god, holy crap. 
Let's go ahead and use a healing potion, which recovers all HP. Interesting that they give you a full HP recovery right off the bat as an item to pick up. This needs to stop. This is... Okay. Okay. No, thank you. I don't know if there's really any reason to kill them when I really think about it. It's just... I don't know. Cool. N let's not get stuck there. Okay. I don't really... No, oh, no, no. I really don't think there is a reason in particular to say, like, hey, let's let's kill this guy. I mean, maybe try and hope for mad drops. Yeah, I need another healing potion. This... I, these were the wrong guys to dance with when there were this many of them. Not hard individually. Oh, oh no, it's locked. And I'm one tonned again. Fantastic. Alright, what is weak durability wise right now? My long sword is losing its durability. <sighs> okay, I want to make sure it doesn't break. But I don't think I have anything in particular that's like high. Oh, the rapier is pretty good. Alright, let's switch to the rapier. It's got durability left. It's got durability to spare. The one ton effect is horrible for these guys. Okay. Mm, cool, guys. Cool. Oh, hey, there's another door. I didn't even notice this one. Um. Hey, you can't go that way. The floor is covered with poison. Come this way. I wish I knew who was talking to me. Oh. Hey, what's up, bro? Okay. Thank you. I appreciate it, dwarf. Alright, let's try... Oh, that was a locked door now. Cool, so there's actually events in this one. That's pretty sick. Fool! Who said you could come in? Um... Okay. Never mind what I just said about the dwarf and being all, like, happy. Like, oh, this dude's my pal. Apparently not. Apparently not. Is the one ton have to do with my weight and what I have equipped? Oh, there really is poison all over the floor. Uh, okay. Well then, let's try to use poison vaccine. Check it out. How about that? Just wish I wasn't at the one ton weight. Does it have to do with what I have equipped? I, I don't. I wonder. All right, let's try this. Let's see if I'm a little faster. Nope. Nope. Alright, go back to the scale mail. Well, for now, I'm cool. There we go. Now we can actually move. Good thing I picked up that poison vaccine. That's pretty sick. Seriously, though, everything really is... Oh! Oh, cool. Don't want to deal with these guys right now because I don't want to be in this poison room. I just don't want to get stuck here and have my poison vaccine wear off. Like, normally I wouldn't care, but I, don't, I really don't want this to wear off. Okay. Oh god. I should really be paying more attention to what's in the place as opposed to trying to wall check. Oh. Okay, cool. Okay, before I do that... Alright, cool. Let's go ahead and climb up the ladder. Alright. Well, now I feel good. I feel better. You cannot go down. Below is overflowing with poison. I didn't know. I had no idea. Thanks for the heads up. What is that noise? It's like a clinking noise. Hey, another shield! Sick. All these bodies. All these dripping poison bodies. Yeah, my poison just ran out too, so it's kind of good timing. Or my poison resist. Okay, so this is probably worse. The shield of resist. Let's see. Overall, it's got worse defense, but its spirit is pretty high, and... Yeah, all of his resistances are much better, which would make sense. So it just depends on if we're fighting elemental or melee, I suppose. So for now, I'll keep my melee shield. I usually... I, it's funny, like, I, I always think to myself that I should switch my shields depending on what situation I get into. And I always for, kind of forget. Because it's just something where I don't want to constantly be switching what I'm wearing. It just seems like a lot of a hassle. Oh, oh no, no, shh. Oh, hi! Cool. It's Chucky. That is exactly what I wanted to fall into. Well, you know what, though? At least it was, wasn't poison. I was I was really concerned that when I fell, I was going to be in poison. 
After I did so much to try and avoid the other one. Alright, well, magical leather armor. It's got worse overall defense, but it's got spirit defense, so... I think this one seems a lot better when I'm wearing it at the moment. Alright. This area is... Kinda creepy. Oh no, not another one ton. It's not your affair, stay out of it! I should really be looking forward, huh? I keep on ruining all the cutscenes. Okay, fine, fine, you're right, it's none of my affair, goodbye. Goodbye, I've got one ton again, I don't want to deal with that, I will stay out of it. I don't even know what, oh, hi, another trucky dude. Actually, you know what it looks more like? It looks like a garden gnome. Which I'd imagine is what it's actually supposed to resemble. He's a little hat. That makes him seem like a garden gnome. You know, I will be coming back, though. I'll be coming back for that jerk. Oh, more coins. We're close to getting that, um, that key that I wanted. Okay. Oh, hey. What's up, bro? I beg of you, stop the rock. It should stop if you stick that sword in the wall. Okay, let's find a story we don't like. Let's find a story we don't like, and let's do it. Alright, let's see. I don't like... Short swords, screw it. No, seriously, though? Like, I I'm willing to help you out, bro. I really gotta figure out how, though. No! No, no, I'm sorry! No! Son of a bitch. Oh no. What did he mean? I was trying. I'm so confused. Is that what it was? Oh. <laughs> Shit. Alright. Uh, that's. Okay then. Totally did not mean to do that. I might have to load my old save at some point. Because I might have screwed up big time. I thought I was swinging high enough that I wouldn't hit him. And I also wasn't expecting a one-hit kill. You see, in King's Field, there are NPCs and you can kill all of them. But it's not a one-hit kill. You can kill them, for sure. It's not going to break my heart if I die at this point. Just, just throwing that out there. Oh, there's the dwarf guy. No. Get your one ton out of here. Okay. Let's, let's deal with more lasers. Cool. Laser. Nope. Stabbing works. Oh, I got another coin. Ah, man. Uh, the further I play... Okay, so here's what's going to happen. If I decide to restart, I will just load it at this point. And that'll be that. If, if I decide to. So after this let's play is over, I'll think about it and decide what I want to do. And if I choose to restart, then that's going to be that. Hey, guy. Hey. What what are you wearing on your head? Alright, that's fine. Look, I don't need to kill him. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Alright, let's figure out which way we want to go. See, I'm a good guy. I, I didn't mean to kill the guy with the boulder on his shoulder. Yay. What is it this way, though? A long, a long maze, which I guess I should have been checking the walls for. Okay. Oh, nice. Healing potion. I was like, just a big, empty room. That's what it's going to lead to. Oh, what? Hello. Dude, in kryptonite? Oh, oh, you need a key for this. Okay. I like the statue, though. Good choice. Good choice to rest under that. So apparently I need a key for that. I wonder if that's what the demon key is going to be for. I wonder. Oh, I am way over time. And by way over, I mean like four minutes. I should really... Okay, as soon as I find a save point, that is going to wrap it up. And then I'll make my decision about what exactly I'm going to do about the whole boulder dude si situation. Alright, let's try the next room down. Oh, 
No. Okay, I guess it's gonna be a shop. So, shield is a shop. At least that's what it would seem like to me. So I surmise. Oh, snake lady. Beast key cost 10. We're getting close. Real close. All right, please lead me back to the beginning. I'm seriously not sure how to get back. Like the boulder guy might have been the way. Oh, uh, okay. Hey, we got more poison resist. That, that's actually pretty helpful. I, I legitimately did not know how to go back at this point though. Cause there's a, that giant boulder in the way, unless this door. Okay, here we go. There, perfect, perfect. I wasn't seeing the door before, so that's where I was confused. All right, well, at least I got the lay of the land down. Okay, so I got this area kind of figured out. I'm gonna go ahead and save it, and then go see what happens if you kill that guy. Let's go ahead and do a different save, just in case. And then I'll figure out exactly what I want to do from that point on. So again, if I do decide to go back so I don't kill the boulder holding guy, I will very specifically try to redo all of this stuff again so I don't have to so you guys don't have to watch it again because that seems like it would be annoying for you but it would just be a you know just a redo all right let's go kill that guy and see what happens but as we wrap it up because I'm actually really curious I've saved my game we're set to go it doesn't matter either way all right where are you trudging along guy um Cannot tell. There's a lot of darkness. No, really though. Where where are you? Okay. It's getting louder here. Oh, noise disappeared. Oh, there he is. It's funny how I just could not find him. Can I talk to you? No. Oh. I had no ill will. Please help me. Apparently that's what you were supposed to do. How 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 do I help you? <laughs> how do I help you? I don't know, so I will kill you. No. <laughs> oh, I feel so bad doing this. So I guess it's not a bad idea to hit him once just to get him to talk to you. So he says that. I think you did mean ill will though when you locked me away and made me go through a poison room. Also, if I think about it, I really should go back and trudge through the top poison again specifically so I can check out the top area. Well, there goes my rapier. My rapier is now broken. Alright, let's equip. Right hand. New weapon! That might have. Okay, a long sword. And since I don't care right now, we're going to go ahead and give it a ton of durability just to try and kill this guy. Let's go with Dorado's Ashes. We got so much durability. This is going to be fantastic. Oh, didn't even need it. Oh, he drops a key thing of some sort. Wait a second. Wait a second. Unlock Spirit Seal. That's how you get that guy. Okay, well, anyways, we're going to try and help him next time and see what happens and see if I can do it without killing him. And I am going to, so this was all just to see what he dropped and all that. But I bet the spirit seal was specifically for what we saw before. So guys, thank you so much for joining me for Let's Play Shadow Tower. And uh, I'll be back next time. See you guys. Peace.